I'll see you later. Take Razor! Take Razor! Get ready for the pain, woman! The pain! Chain is coming! Oh, no! Oh, no! I wish I had 10 Terry Tates on Team Felcher. I just do my job, man. I do what my God-given abilities allow me to do, and I thank Jesus Christ for it every single day. And do I enjoy what I do? <laughs> Hell yeah. Terry had worked for 1,000 straight days without an absence of any kind. <laughs> And state law mandated that he take at least two weeks vacation. Without Terry here, the environment deteriorated rapidly. Things went from bad to worse to downright strange. With Terry back, everything quickly returned to business as usual. I just pray it's another thousand days before we have to do without him again. You want to play games, Gene? Well, Terry's back, and I got a new game for you. It's called How Much Pain Can Gene Stand Before Gene Learns Not to Play Games Anymore? That's my game. That's Terry's game. And when it's game time, it's pain time, baby. Woo! There can be little doubt that this man changed the very sport itself with his speed, skill, and sheer stick to it -ness. You can't hurt this! I'm a machine, Gene! I'm built for this, son! Woo! Woo! Ha <laughs> ha! Devastating. But Terry Tate wasn't always the mean machine we know and love today. Let's take a look back and see from whence this athlete came, shall we? Like many children, Terry was born. Sometime later, Terry attended high school. After graduating as valedictorian and captain of the football team, Terry decided to accept a full scholarship to Major University. And it was while attending Major University that Terry reached a fork in the road. A fork of destiny. During his Halcyon collegiate days, Terry experimented with a freelance mime troupe and discovered a talent that even he didn't know he had. He could have been one of the greats. The world was his tacit oyster. Terence could have had everything, the wealth, the women, but... Terry had his demons, and eventually, his demons had him. You know how it is. Right. You're kidding me. <laughs> you respect the arts, or the arts will respect you! Your ass trapped in my box now, baby! Terry's paying in my box of pain! And there ain't no escape from that! Whoa! From the moment I saw him, I knew that Terry was exactly what Team Felcher needed. We had experimented with other athletes before, though without what one might call success. So it was that Terry Tate, office linebacker, came to be. And Felcher and Sons would never be the same again. Look, man, there ain't no secret to success in business or in life. The solution is simple, baby. 100% hard. All day, every day. Only quitters quit, and Triple T is a hitter. <laughs> Not a quitter. Believe that. You give me Tippy Torn! I'll be here! What the hell are you? I'm Linka, and I'm a senior game designer on World of Warcraft, and uh, specifically, I spend most of my time uh, working on PvP. I've seen you before. You're the asshole on TV. Absolutely. You know, Warlords of Draenor is a very exciting time for anyone that likes PvP in the World of Warcraft. <laughs> Bring a lot of changes. There's really more to do as a PvP player in World of Warcraft than ever before. And a big part of that is Ashran. Bullshit. Bullshit. <laughs> Bullshit. 
bullshit. Bullshit! You sell some? It's all bullshit. All of it. It's a whole new dynamic to world PvP in, uh, in Warlords Draenor. You're fucking high! Are you out of your mind? Ashran, I think, is really what WoW PvP, like, people kind of expect. This it's is a fucking prison on planet bullshit! In the galaxy of this sucks camel dicks! You see that white dog crap? Do you see it? Yeah. Not too fun down there, is it? No. You see your actions have consequences. When you oppress people, they rise up 